Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro 2020 tutorial. In this one, I'm going to teach you how to clear your media disk cache or your file cache, not just your temporary stuff, but your long-term stuff too. It's new features inside Premiere Pro 2020. Let's get right into it. Alright guys, I'm on a Mac, and what you want to do is you first you want to click over to your preferences. It's under Premiere Pro Preferences on a... PC, it should be under File, and then at the bottom, it'll say Preferences, I believe. So just find your Preferences, then you want to hover over, and you want to go to Media Cache. Now, immediately, you're going to see something new here, and that is the Delete Media Cache Files. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I often have lots of these stored up, and if you do lots of video editing, you don't delete them very often, or you don't go in and manually chuck them, well, your drive tends to fill up with a whole bunch of gibber. So the first step here is we're just going to go ahead and delete it. And you're going to see here two options, delete unused media cache files, which we can do. And then there's also delete all media cache files from the system. This one's actually really, really important. And we'll go into that one next. So we're just going to do this first. I'm going to hit OK, and it's gone. Now, when I hit delete again, you're going to notice here that I cannot cl click delete all media cache files from the system. That's a problem. The reason why is we're opened in a project. Or you're just actually, well, yeah, you're in Project Media Cache Files here. I'm just in a new project. But actually, to delete everything off your system, you have to do a fresh launch, and you can't have really anything open. So I'm going to close this bad boy right here, and boom, it's gone. Now, the next step, come on, close up for me, is we want to go back into Applications. And then for me, I've got it here, Premiere Pro 2020. Double click on it. There we go. And then I'm going to load it. Now here's the here's the important part. I'm going to close that, close that. Now while it loads here, right at the loading screen, this is where you need to be in order to delete everything. You got to go to find Premiere Pro, find your preferences, go down to Media Cache, and then click on. Come on, slow poke. Delete. There we go. <laughs> delete all Media Cache files from the system. Now I'm going to hit OK and it's going to search your system. If you've got your cache files in multiple places, or maybe you've had Adobe downloaded on different drives, and you've got cache files in your C drive, and your D drive, and your E drive, whatever, guys, this will scan the whole system, show you how to do it, guys. It can save you, a, it could really save you a ton of space on your hard drive, and that's it, guys. That's how you do it. So thanks for watching this video. i got a ton more stuff coming up. Stay tuned.